Okay, you guys, we're looking at 150,000 BTU furnace. Looking at replacing this, it has a cracked heat exchanger, as well as the evaporator coil and supply plenum. Uh, the return drop is 10 by 24 by, I believe, I think 79 and a half. I got it written down. Uh, we want to look at moving this over some to allow for our 5 inch filter, modify the gas and electric to the new furnace. Uh, flue piping comes over, runs out. Uh, through the chimney. Um, the homeowner believes there's a flue liner. I do not see a mortar sleeve. Um, so we'll look into this a little bit closer and see what we're going to do there. And I'll also look into a spot and note on the checklist where we need to go out with PVC should they go high efficient. Um, at a later date, we'll probably look at the duct work just to see that it's working or that it's uh, the right size. Right now it's cur covered up by the ceiling. Um, basically over on another spot but uh, that's all coming down they want me to look at that again they do have an april air 700 humidifier already installed we can look at bringing on a new pad <clears throat> and condensate drain um we're gonna replace the hose obviously that runs behind the unit comes over and then hits the floor drain over here so we'll look at replacing that um and that's about it oh line set line set comes up runs over and actually goes into the other room I'll get dimensions of that uh, yeah I'll get dimensions of that too looks like it runs over in the choice space and just sits on the back side of the home or the left, right side of the home <clears throat>